As Eric Baston progressed through to the final of the USA Champs, how does it feel for him to carry on the Drake Relays torch? Probably better than it does for Cole Hocker, not carrying on the Oregon torch. So, um, yeah, changing of the guard uh, at Drake a little bit. Um, he got through, um, obviously, just to not get myself in trouble. Cole, amazing athlete, and I'm pretty sure he's been injured. But, um, yeah, huge run for Baston. Uh, I haven't actually seen a video of the full heat, but he always finds a way to get through. Um, yeah, and he's really helping put Drake on the map even more and uh, really get Drake's name out there. And I don't know, in tomorrow's US final, God, I wouldn't be surprised if he wins it. I think if he gets it right, he can beat anyone now. It's, yeah. Uh, especially since Cole's out. And since you uh, did yeah. name drop him, to get the views on the channel. God, yeah, you got to tag him now. opinion that. thrown around that he, didn't, he shouldn't have dodged races, which personally, I think he's never really been one to race all the races. Yeah. And let's be honest, Cole tactically last year also was always near the back of the field and his kick was what did it for him and yeah. he hasn't quite had his kick this year the same so where's your opinion on that in terms of his racing schedule and what you think he should have done I haven't really got a problem with it um I mean he was six at the Olympics he's run 331 and 350 uh, and he's like two and a half years younger than me so I can't really I can't really say anything bad about him um yeah I mean it's a big shame for him to miss out on that final I have heard he's been injured I don't really know anything about it but um I mean last year uh I saw your post on Trackstar today actually last year he won three NCAA titles and um I think maybe having a few more of those college races last year did kind of get him a bit sharper but uh, honestly I think the college system you're racing so early so much like from I think they ran 350 in what like February so um he was pretty sharp pretty early and i i don't know i'm sure he'll he'll get that back um he ran what 351 like a month ago at pre so um yeah i think i think he's in pretty good shape i just think obviously you know you have ups and downs and it didn't quite go his way at um us trials but i doubt he's a one-year wonder i'm sure he'll be back um and i mean on any given day when he's in his best shape i don't think many people in the world can close harder than him so 331 speaks for itself, six at the Olympics, um, yeah.